Good evening. Thank you for joining us. Uh, we're so glad to be able to collaborate uh, together with these vocal piano songs um, in remembrance of Eric tonight. Yeah, I was so grateful that we were able to have this opportunity to share some music that's really special to me and um, to share a special message to Eric's family and to all of our friends and students at Nazareth College. Uh, the last time that I was able to see Eric was in early September and we were talking about how in the midst of a pandemic can we bring together something that's beautiful for people and we thought about doing a Rodgers and Hammerstein concert and so I thought that would be a really appropriate way to um, bring some music together to honor him. And certainly one of the ways that I know that I go through the grieving process as a musician is that I use my music to do that. And when I was thinking about how special Eric's heart is and what a meaningful piece that would be when you're talking about the sound of music resonating through and speaking to a heart, that's something that I thought would be really appropriate to sort of take that piece out of context. One of my other favorite pieces is No One Is Alone from Into the Woods. And I think in this time of a pandemic, especially, we've all learned that. And we also know that this is something that we can take with us in all of our trials that we go through. So that message is really important. And I think everyone also knows um, the beautiful words of You'll Never Walk Alone from Carousel because that speaks, that's a timeless message to hold our chin up high. And, more than ever have we learned that this year, all of these things. And so I thought they would really be a beautiful way to connect and collaborate to bring that message to you. And believe me, I am singing it to myself as I do it as well. Uh, the last time we actually all got to, to work together and make music together was um, a year and a half ago or so uh, for the Lori Leitman concert. Uh, she was in town as a composer in residence at NAS, and we all had a wonderful time collaborating, singing, and working with her. Uh, I just remember that, that time together and really cherish it with Eric. Yeah, and we got to sing, I think, some of the funniest pieces. Mm -hmm. um, at the, the end, the encore that we did was really, really funny, and we took a selfie on stage. Eric <laughs> did that in the spur of the moment because he was such a good character, actor, and singer. Uh, I think we had so much fun in rehearsals mm -hmm. doing that, and we even tried to get you to make some silly <laughs> sounds with us. Um, and I think also one of the most poignant pieces of music was this beautiful poem that was also a duet called I Am In Need Of Music. And it really, really speaks to the human condition and how much we need, uh, once again, to process our, our daily life, but um, especially our emotions in a time where things are unfathomable. And so this is really a, a beautiful piece that we were able to share. Um, and I still, I still think about those moments. Me too, me too. Yeah, what was something that you remembered when, like during our rehearsal process or on stage during those times? I will always remember the photos that we took afterwards. <laughs> and there's one where we made a whole bunch of silly faces and uh, it, yeah. it was just so much fun uh, working with everybody. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. I, with Eric, you like never knew it was going to happen like on stage, which was like the best part. Like, I think that's a great moment of being a performer because it was fun for me to be in, be in the moment like that and to be able to play off of each other and because we have uh, such an experienced pianist with us that also was able to just be right there with us at every moment. It made it so easy for us to have fun. Right. And especially with difficult, I mean, the, the pieces were not easy, but mm -hmm. they seemed easy once we all were together doing them. So right. yeah. yeah, it was really fun. I'm really grateful for that time. Me too. Yeah. Well, I'm really grateful that we're able to share this beautiful medley with you. And I know that you're listening, Eric, and that you're with us. And I hope that you enjoy this medley of Rogers and Hammerstein and Sondheim. And I hope that it speaks to your heart today. Thank you. 
like a brook when it trips and falls over stones in its way to sing through the night like a lark who is learning. Yes. 